10 websites to make money online in 2020 no credit card required hey I'm JR Fisher welcome to my channel in this video I'm going to show you how you can make money online no credit card required now, I had to do some real research for this because this needs to work anywhere in the world and for those of you who are not in the US or Canada the UK or Australia there is a hack in here that I want to show you so that you can operate your business from anywhere in the world and we're starting right now Hey, if you're new to my channel do me a favor and subscribe hit the subscribe button down there and don't forget turn on notifications ring the bell down there and when you do that make sure you set it for all notifications that way when I do a new video you will be notified and when I go live you'll be notified and you can join me on a live call and we can actually talk so please 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 do that also I want to give you a $97 course absolutely free it's in the description at the end of this video you'll find it down there all you got to do is click and learn no credit card required so there's a lot of ways to make money online and some of them are legitimate some of them are not now I've gone through this entire list and I have 10 ways for you to make money online that are all legitimate and each one varies on how much you can make but you can make money on all of these sites so let's go ahead and get started and go through them right now okay the first site I want to talk about is a site called red bubble and we're gonna go over to red bubble right now and I want to show you on my screen here and you can kind of see how it works and what we're doing okay we're over here at Redbubble right now and I just logged into their site right here and you can see they have all kinds of really really cool stuff here so at Redbubble what you're gonna be doing basically is you're gonna be selling all types of products you can sell clothing we'll click on clothing here let's do hoodies and sweatshirts and you design it and all you do is upload the design and Redbubble actually does the marketing so they're bringing people to the site where people can buy these different products and let's check out this one here all right and these are hoodies and what you do is you select whatever design you have you upload it and then once you upload it they put it on one of these for you people come to the site buy these products and when they buy them you get paid a particular commission so you're not actually uh, packaging this you don't actually buy it and get it to your house all you do is put your product at red bubble and they pay you a commission now there's a couple things about about red bubble I want to talk to you about real quick so red bubble is going to pay you either to a bank account or they're going to pay you through PayPal now if you're in some countries um, they're not going to offer that payment to the bank in some other countries so depending on the country that you live in red bubble does not allow payments to go to some of these countries so you wouldn't be eligible but there is a hack to that uh, in some countries I know you can't use PayPal but there's a hack to that so at red bubble which you can do is you can use a site called Payoneer. Let's go over there real quick. Okay, so I'm at Payoneer right now, and it says go beyond your passport to global growth. And basically, what it is is you can receive payments on Payoneer. Now, what you'll need to do is you'll need to integrate that with Redbubble. Now, the problem you're going to run into is that Redbubble is going to say, well, we need a street address for Payoneer, and Payoneer does not have a street address anywhere on here. You can't find it, but I figured out if you actually email Payoneer they will send you the street address a US street address so that you can actually give that address to Redbubble and when you do that they can make all the payments there and you kind of hack the system so that way no matter where you are in the world you can actually use Payoneer because Payoneer pretty much works anywhere in the world the only hack is that you know we have to have an address and they will send you the address if you email for it so that way you can use it on Redbubble and sell all your products there now the next site I want to tell you about number two is Skillshare Skillshare is an amazing site and any skills that you have you can actually make a course and put it on there I mean anybody can make a class and put it on Skillshare it's super easy to do I mean you, you just need a phone you don't have to have fancy camera equipment you have to do anything so let's go over to Skillshare real quick and let's check it out now the way Skillshare works is people will pay uh, and let's click on this button here they'll pay a fee of let's say $15 a month to join and then they get access to all these courses on here and the way you're gonna get paid is that when you let me go ahead and log in real quick 
Okay, so once you log in here, you can type in anything you want. Let's put in Photoshop. And then I can see what courses are available there and you see all these different Photoshop courses here uh, this guy here's got 21,000 students this one's got 6,000 it's the same guy it looks like <laughs> or else these both these guys buy funny glasses um, so there's all kinds of different courses in here uh, we'll pick this particular one here um, this is Adobe Photoshop and as you go through this course you, you know it's gonna log minutes and as it logs minutes the creators of these courses actually get paid money based on how many minutes of their courses were watched and let me go back I'm gonna pick something else um, I'll pick gardening right now so we have a different subject that's there we go okay so we'll go to this one here it only has 23 students and I wanted to pick one that has a low amount of students so I can see the quality of the actual videos they put in here so let's go ahead and go in here okay the beginning one I can watch I can't watch the next one unless I pay so let's go ahead now as you see this particular one looks like it's just a bunch of pictures so somebody's made a, a, an entire course here on taking pictures of stuff narrating over it and calling it a course now if you notice this is a four minute video six minute four minute three minute seven minute so there's only five lessons here it's a total of 26 minutes anybody can do this anybody can do this anybody can make a course on Skillshare and put it on there and you could be making money okay if you've got a cell phone you know you could do this you could take pictures right now this person here took pictures most of these are videos uh, this particular one isn't let me see if any of the other ones here I can see is a video okay so this is a video and this this looks like a pretty good quality one here it's got some jump cuts and they're showing you know how to do gardening and all that so you know that's that's a one minute video the intro one the intro one's only one minute long and then the other ones are this one here's like 23 seconds so they didn't put a whole lot of time into this so you know the people that make courses on here can make a lot of money depending on how many people watch the course how many want how much watch time they actually get on the course now it, it actually says on their site that first-time teachers can make anywhere from between three hundred and three thousand dollars their very first month now three thousand dollars can be a life-changing thing to some people but you know imagine you're only making five hundred bucks on a course a month that's recurring income so it's five hundred dollars every month it's not five hundred dollars one time now imagine if you had two courses you're a thousand dollars or you know if you you had ten courses on there at five hundred now up to five thousand dollars that is a job replacing income by doing 10 short courses on Skillshare now there's no guarantee you're gonna make exactly that amount of money I don't know how much you're gonna make on there but the point is you can make money on there and you can do it from anywhere in the world okay number three is Udemy I want to take you over there right now let's take a look at this site see how it works it's very similar to Skillshare but it's a little bit different in as much as you actually sell your courses people don't pay access to get you know access to the entire site and all the courses they have to buy the individual courses so you're gonna to want to have a little bit better quality course on there but let's check it out and see what we find okay I'm here at Udemy right now and I typed in gardening so these are some of the courses we got here and let's check out some of the ones that pop up um, this person here has sold seven well they've got you know 763 ratings we don't have any courses they actually sold uh, but probably a whole lot more than that at $24.99 and they're gonna pay you a commission based on what you sold on this particular site but you will notice most of these uh, courses on here are very cheap $11 $10 whatever uh, here, here's a course for a dollar okay so they get some pretty cheap courses but let's look at the quality of one of these and just see what we have this one here has 37 lectures in here and I think we can see part of one of these oh this is going into yoga let's get off that one there that's the other thing about putting your course on one of these sites like this you're gonna get marketed to uh, other courses so you know you don't have that control over it uh, it does say that there were 1500 students enrolled at 1199 so you can do the math on that one uh, and you can see what they do and then it tells you right here what the course includes so all you really need is a decent camera and most phones have a decent camera then you could be selling on Udemy now up on the screen right now 
I'm gonna put the actual uh, number of courses and percent of total Udemy courses so you can kind of see what the earnings are uh, at ten dollars per enrollment so they use ten dollars as an example here you can see if you had uh, an enrollment range of let's say a thousand people uh, ten dollars uh, per and uh, your earnings at ten dollars per would be anywhere from five thousand to twenty five thousand dollars which you know that's pretty good you're gonna get these percentages of the courses here depending upon the total Udemy courses there are on that particular subject so you know if you have um, 50,000 right here and there's 67 courses like that you're gonna get 13% uh, or 250,000 to 500,000 dollars so a lot of money can be made on these courses but you may be saying to me JR I don't I don't have any skills I can't do anything there's nothing I can do I don't know anything at all then then learn something I mean really it's that easy you know if you can you know go to YouTube and watch some tutorial videos and watch enough of them you could learn a subject and once you learn a subject you can get your phone and you can record yourself and you could do a PowerPoint slide you could put pictures up there like that one I showed you on Skillshare where they, they didn't even record any video they just showed pictures and talked over it so you could even do that and then you say well JR I'm so worried about you know how I sound and I sound different and you know people are gonna make fun of me and all that I said well I, I'll tell you this if you're a little bit different if your voice sounds a little bit different if it's not as normal as everybody else's is your courses will actually sell better I know I know that sounds crazy but they do uh, I know a girl in New Zealand and she has a little bit of a, a speech affect and she's blown up online she's done great because of that difference in speech if you sound like everybody else it's boring like I kind of sound like everybody else I have kind of a, a regular voice so don't let that worry you that's probably too your advantage that you sound a little bit different now you may say well I, I, I kind of know how to do Photoshop but you know you got to pay for Photoshop and so I can't do any Photoshop videos yes you can matter of fact Photoshop actually has a seven-day free trial so go sign up for it and work really hard for seven days and do some Photoshop tutorials and you'll have them done and it didn't cost you anything then you may say to me well wait a second JR I can't do that because I don't have the software for screen recording and if I don't if I can't record my screen then of course I can't do these videos yes you can you can use OBS studios you can look it up OBS studios it's a free screen recording software and if you use OBS you can go ahead and do all the screen recording you want and then you say but wait JR you don't understand I don't have the right microphone my, my microphone won't be good on my computer I can't use it you have a phone right most of the phones nowadays have incredible audio on them you can turn that on and record your audio track on this right and then you have it for your training there's really no excuses for this you can actually do this okay so the next thing you could do to make money number four would be to use affiliate programs now affiliate programs are great because they're gonna pay you you don't have to deliver anything you don't have to create anything so let's say you have a blog let's say you're doing some videos on YouTube or whatever you can actually review products from Amazon on YouTube and in the description area down there you just put a link to Amazon and you're not gonna get paid a really super high percentage but it's money it's more money than you would have if you did not do something so you can do that you can find other products that have affiliate offers and do it that way there's so many companies that have affiliate offers out there right now and you could do a review of that product put it on YouTube and start making money on it number five is Shutterstock now let's run over to Shutterstock real quick and I'll show you how you can make some money on it okay here I am at Shutterstock right now and if you notice it's divided into videos editorial music elements tools images so let's go with images right here we'll go home of images and you can see that you can get 10 images for the annual plan of two dollars and nine cents where are all these images come from where are all these videos come from where are all these sounds come from they come from people uploading them to Shutterstock and getting paid a commission so you can actually do that so let's search um, nice house nice house something really simple and let's see what's in here and there you go people have gone out and taken these 4k pictures now I will say on something like Shutterstock you do want to try to take 4k pictures because you'll get more money for them so if you have a higher quality picture you're going to get paid more on Shutterstock 
Now the question is, does anybody really buy any pictures on the Shutterstock? Do they really buy videos? Of course they do. They need this stuff and it's a whole lot easier to go there and pay a few bucks than to get in your car and drive to the park and take pictures of trees. It's a whole lot easier to sit at your desk and pay five or 10 bucks and get what you want right there. Now you understand that there's millions of people that access these sites, millions and millions of people. So the more pictures you upload, the more videos you upload, the more money you can make on one of these sites. And, and I know I've bought pictures on a lot of these sites and I've, I have a subscription to video blocks, which is another one I didn't even mention. Um, but there's so many sites out there like this, but that Shutterstock's a great one to start with and you can be making money every single month. And I use video blocks every single month. I pull stuff out of there. I use it for my videos. I'll probably use it when I edit some of these videos here. So people do pay for this stuff and yes, you can make money doing it. Now the next site I want to show you number six is merch by Amazon so let's go over there real quick and I'm gonna show you merch by Amazon and how you can make money there okay I'm over here at merch by Amazon and um, this operates a whole lot like these print on demand companies and it is a print on demand company because basically all you do it's right here in the center you upload your artwork you set a list price they print what's sold and then you get a commission and it's really that easy and you can see you can do t-shirts you can do mugs um, and you can see some of the companies that use it Disney and Adult Swim and Marvel and Dr. Seuss and Universal uh, and the advantage to this is you don't really have to drive anybody to the site because Amazon is already a destination site Amazon is like eBay which is a destination site there's already people going there they're already searching for these particular products now the cool thing is that you don't have to spend money on advertising that you don't have to have any money for investment that you don't have to pay for a membership or anything to join merch by Amazon now the downside to merch by Amazon is that if they are buying your products there the suggested products are going to be from other people they're not going to be suggesting your products so keep in mind you're getting the advantage of that and keep in mind also that you're going to get a lower commission because they are having to pay for all the advertising they set up the platform all you do is upload an image and make a product that's actually on Online, it's a virtual product but they're gonna ship it out for you they're gonna send it out they are gonna do all that stuff for you and you can make money immediately on merch by Amazon so that's our next one okay the next site I want to tell you about is Fiverr 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 is a great site and it kind of got a bad rap because everybody thinks well I want to work on a site where you only make five dollars but that's really not what it's about there are gigs on there for five dollars but there's also gigs on there for five hundred dollars so it's just a good starting point so let's run over there real quick and I want to show you what it looks like okay so here we are at Fiverr right now and let's try uh, logos and just see what we get here and see what pops up so we've got all these people here creating logos so if you've got some artwork skill something along those lines um, you could actually go in here and charge for logos like this guy here starting at $45 uh, and these these are minimalist business logos so let's take a look and see what he's got uh, and you can see these are just you know some it, it's really just a font on a background right here and he's doing these logos right here for $45 and then he's got packages down here uh, and if you notice you can go up to $160 for the premium package and he shows you what you get for that and he's probably using a logo creating software or a logo creating site that he's paying half the price for and then selling this service on Fiverr because people don't know that they can just go online and create their own logos so that's one thing you can do but there's all kinds of things maybe you write content maybe you write copy you know may, maybe you do data entry all of that and let me just put data entry in here if you want really low level um, items that anybody can do anybody can you know type stuff into a keyboard I mean I can't even type but I can type stuff into a keyboard and here's data entry right here and this particular one starts at $20 uh, he will work two hours a week formatting and cleanup graph or table creation whatever you want uh, for $20 so you know he's obviously working for 10 bucks an hour but there are different levels if you compare packages here uh, he's got his $50 premium which is six hours and he gives you a little bit of a discount now that's nine ten bucks an hour which is not much money but there's people out there driving uber for you know eight or ten dollars an hour and they have to drive their own car around they have to buy gas they have to leave their home you know you can sit on your couch and do this uh, and he's a low-level person but there's people at $20 an hour $50 an hour there's things you can do on here to generate money 
the next site I want to tell you about which is number eight is text broker oh my god text broker is amazing all you gotta do is write if you can write and spell you can make money on text broker now most people and let's run over to text broker real quick okay here we are at text broker now most people who come on to text broker if they have you know if their native language is English they're gonna rank at about a four star okay so a four star is pretty darn good and I think that's gonna earn you roughly 15 to 20 dollars an hour depending on how fast you write um, but with a little bit of expertise a little bit of work you can work your way up to uh, let me to write content here let's see here let's take a look uh, you can work your way up to five star five star is gonna pay you about fifty dollars an hour fifty dollars an hour is pretty darn good money um, you know if you work you know six hours a day six times five that's three hundred dollars a day um, some people work an entire week and not make that amount of money so you can see in here they have a free author registration uh, you can see the people that use it yo staples eBay uh, all these companies are using text broker uh, and then it shows you the different levels here at five star you're getting five cents a word that's pretty darn good and if you're a fast typist you can you can crush it here you can make a lot of money now it's not getting rich it's not making millions of dollars a year but it can be a job replacing income for you if you don't have another way to make money this is a great way to start okay and number nine is freelancer.com freelancer is very similar to Fiverr but let's run over there and take a look at it real quick okay here we are at freelancer.com and they tell you how it works here you can also browse jobs if you're looking for jobs so you can actually go in here and find a job you want um, this particular one here must have knowledge of whatever you put in whatever your knowledge is so let's put in a keyword in here we'll put Photoshop okay I've got Photoshop in there online job and you can see that uh, a logo for kitchen purposes six days left on this they pay $23 an hour on that job uh, looking for Adobe Photoshop expert $92 on that job uh, let's see architectural elements if you're into that type stuff so 185 bucks so all over the place there's one for $13 an hour if you want to do data entry uh, simple banner designs $88 $149 for social media advertising designer I mean there's just all kinds of jobs in here it doesn't matter what your skills are if you know anything at all and like I said if you don't know anything at all which that's pretty rare that nobody knows anything but you can go to YouTube and learn anything for free you can just go to YouTube and watch the videos so let's go on to number 10 in our last one and that is upwork.com so let's run over there real quick okay I'm here at upwork.com right now uh, you can see mobile development web development design writing let's just click on writing since we're on that theme right now and kind of see what people are looking for um, short-term tasks reoccurring projects full-time work now right in here you can see what people are charging this person charges $40 an hour $60 an hour and this person here if you look at this look at what they're writing public relations travel and website analytics okay those are her skills at $60 an hour this one here is an academic writer so she'll do research for you it looks like she's in Minneapolis uh, this person here check this out Instagram Facebook and social media marketing a hundred and twenty five dollars an hour guys a hundred and twenty five dollars an hour you know people are struggling out there to get fifteen dollars an hour you know working in some fast food joint and you can go online and not even leave your house and make hundred and twenty five dollars an hour now granted she's probably pretty good at what she does but the way she got good I'm gonna give you the big secret about this is she did something that's how you get good at things you actually do something and if you actually do something and you do it enough times and you try hard enough guess what you get better at it and the better you get at it guess what people pay you more money so that's something to consider too and that's number 10 okay so there's 10 simple easy ways you can make money no matter where in the world you are you can make money doing this stuff guys I can't impress this upon you enough so if you think you're at a disadvantage if you think you can't do these things you think you're in the wrong country you think because you gotta have a certain bank none of that is true none of that is true you can actually make money online I spent a lot of time researching this um, so take advantage of it go out there and make some money and then you make some money on one of these sites you can invest it in your own business you can invest it the e-commerce whatever you want which reminds me don't forget below there is a link to my $97 e-commerce course you can get absolutely free doesn't cost you a dime just click on the link it's kind of like all these things I just told you about it's free click on it and learn and you can learn how to do some e-commerce now also don't forget if you haven't subscribed already hit that subscribe button below that's so very important you got to do that hit the bell notifications next to the subscribe button there don't forget turn on all 
bell notifications it'll make you part of the Fisher family the VIP family right you're gonna be notified when I upload videos you're gonna be notified when I go live so you don't miss a single thing now I want to hear your comments below have you visited any of these sites have you tried any of these things what have you done to make money online not what have you heard about what have you actually done now if you have questions about how to do any of these things also put those questions in the comments below I'd love to get your questions thank you so much for listening to this video and I'll see you in the next one hey thanks for watching my video don't forget to subscribe to my channel and click that little bell right here so you can be notified every time I do a new video also click on one of those videos there keep watching on my channel